guys! Hope everybody is doing great. Today, if you can believe it, is May 1st. Welcome to the No Judgment Zone, okay? All of us need a haircut, we need hair color, we need lip waxes, we need brow waxes. My lashes here are, I've got like three on this side and five on this side. And it's just, we need manicures, pedicures, we need it all, okay? So, um, no judging, okay? As you know, we are all in this crazy, um, these crazy times where we are stuck at home for the most part and we are doing less cosmetology teachers, we're doing distance learning, uh, online teaching, um, students are doing online learning, bless their hearts, or at least trying to some of them. Um, and we're just trying to get through this. Um, we have been told that school will not um, go back this, this school year. So that is definitely a challenge. On this channel, as you know, usually I record myself as a cosmetology instructor, and I um, encourage other instructors, um, my focus primarily um, are new instructors, just because I wish somebody would have told me these things when I was a brand new teacher, it would have saved so much time. Um, and I like to share what I do in the classroom, how I do some of my lessons, organizational tips, things of the sort. And then another thing that I do on this channel, another type of video that I record are demos of lessons that I do, not only to show the other instructors, but also to record what I teach in class so that if a student is absent or if they need to go back at a later time, I can review it early, I guess, maybe late March, early April, when our principal told us that we had 30 minutes to go to our classrooms and get either our computers or our materials or anything that we needed. We have 30 minutes when, when, when he sent that email and um, I knew that I was gonna have a short amount of time to get everything that I needed, I made a list. And my thing was because I had kind of this whole thing intrigued me, so I kind of had done a little research on the swine flu and how how that outbreak happened and how, how for those times back then, how quickly it spread, how long it took, things of the sort with this and nowadays and the way we travel and commute and things of the sort, I thought, well, this might, we might be in it for a long haul. So I thought, okay, well, I'm just gonna make a list of things that I need for sure for now, but in case that this goes longer, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my materials that I need to at least do demos of what we would have been doing in class so that the students, my freshmen and sophomores have their kids at home. I'm glad I made my sophomores take their kids home. Um, and their nail kits, and so in case this goes longer, then I'll have content. I can I can have materials and supplies at home to make videos to have content to post so that students can at least watch what they would have been doing in class. And then since they have their materials at home, they're able to practice it at home. Now they don't get TDL or credit for that, but they at least don't get behind in their on their skills. So, um, I figured, okay, we'll, we'll online teach, get used to it March, because we really started at March 23rd, so it was like that last week or two of March, just getting a hang of getting everybody to log in, and that was a whole hassle. Um, and then April came around, um, so March was just editing videos. Now, the last video I posted was before we took off on the cruise, the senior cruise, and so I have those that footage from that point forward. Um, so I'll be posting those as well um, and the new videos too. So it's not gonna go in a sequential order. So just so you know, I also have SkillsUSA um, district officers um, on our campus and throughout the district um, that I'm um, responsible for. So I also have trainings and like summer camp videos 
from previous times that I'm also going to be posting so I can share that with them. So there's going to be a lot of different different content on the on the channel. Um, so just so you know. Another thing is once I was recording the videos and um, was really kind of struggling with having students log on and complete their work, I thought I'm not going to give them this hands-on content to focus on during this time when they need to focus on what their theory, what they really need to do for their TDLR hours and for their um, grade. So, you know, if I give them these videos to do in practice facials, that's great, but they're not getting graded, uh, graded for it or any credit. So I'm gonna hold off, I'm gonna make the videos hold off on posting them for a later time. And then in April, I just wanted to focus on getting students through getting their hours online and making sure that they get their grades. Most everybody's doing all right. And so I feel I'm at a point where the students are at a point where, okay, now you kind of get the hang of it. We're doing good, you're doing good. Let's go ahead and start putting out that content. So May 1st was the day that I thought, okay, it's the last month of school. They're gonna need a little extra bump of encouragement and um, something different to do other than just the online tedious everyday type of, uh, type of deal. So keeping in mind that they're not just having cosmetology classes, okay? Or, or, or activities or lessons or reading or whatnot to do. They also have math, science, social studies, and all those other things that require their time and attention. So the videos should be short. My goal is to keep them between 15 to 20 minutes long. Um, so it's a quick, easy watch. Um, and then also to, um, just uh, something that, that students, you guys can follow along with, okay? So, um, that's kind of how all of that happened. Um, and then also too, just a few personal, you know, how's the new office? Cause we switched, my husband and I are both teachers. So we both were fighting over volume. Um, we have high ceilings and it's a little open here in the house. And so we're kind of both fighting over volume of who's louder while we're having conference calls, arts and meetings and things. Um, and so we went ahead and just turned our master or our guest bedroom into the office. And my old studio is just kind of the storage room right now um, because the bed is in there and all my materials are in there. And so then all my recording I'm doing in the new location, the new office. So just so you know, change of scenery and sometimes I'll be here in the dining room or sometimes in the living room because the lighting is better in one spot of the house um, than uh, another depending on what time I'm recording. I'm excited to share these new videos with you. Um, some again are beneficial to the students, some are beneficial to cosmetology instructors, some are just just because or cooking videos. I've been doing a lot of cooking, so that's exciting. I'll be sharing some of those recipes as well. Um, and then I have a few ideas as well with the channel and the direction that I wanna take it in. Um, so I hope you like it. Um, and I think that's it that I wanted to share with you. Also, I wanna share the story of this semester um, at school and, and kind of the why I had stopped recording, um, or not recording, but posting. Well, yeah, recording. I have a lot of content, I just haven't, hadn't put it out. Um, so I wanna also share that story um, with you guys as well. Um, it's close to my heart. So that also you shall come. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, I'm gonna end this video here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so that you get, and click that bell so you get notifications when a new video pops up. Students, don't forget to practice. Don't forget to wash your hands, sanitize as best as you can. You have your um, little disinfectant in your, in your kits and your brushes and things of the sort. So please 
don't forget to do that. I know you're at home and you're just working on mannequins or whatnot, but when you transfer from a mannequin to a human, please make sure to, or human, human, please make sure to um, follow those um, chapter five <laughs> procedures as you have learned them. All right, so we'll see you guys on the first video.